Hi everyone, this is Jamie Sorensen here at Two Peas in a Bucket with another weekly warehouse walk showing you new products in the warehouse. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Uh, it slipped my mind this morning when I was getting dressed, but <laughs> happy St. Patrick's Day to you and congrats to Dylee87. You are our winner from last week. Thanks for watching and commenting. A prize will be sent to you shortly. So I have new Bella Boulevard to show you. There are a few collections here. I'm going to start out showing you the um, tail waggers collection. So if you have pets, um, this collection is for you. It has cute little cat and dog icons um, and Bella's great bright color scheme. show you a few patterns here and then the main element stickers and ele alphabet stickers, excuse me. Here's where they have the quadrant of all four patterns. The 12 by 12 sticker sheet is great in that it gives you a full alphabet in that really funky font style that borders in all of your stickers here. Another sticker, 12 by 12 sticker sheet. And then this is what they're calling cute cuts. So it's a piece of paper, so it gives you the option of having the pattern on the background. But if you want to cut out the elements here, you can. The next collection I have to show you is called um, Family Dynamics. And I am particularly fond of this collection because it's all about family and it has this fun game theme. And I love sitting around the table and playing family games with my family. So it, um, this pattern is super cute with the different playing cards and then it has lots of different designs that work well with this theme. This is a teeny tiny print with sayings that say things like we are family, family is love, family spends time together, family plays games together, etc. Um, the cute cuts for the family dynamics looks like this. And then this is the Alpha and Bits 12 by 12 sticker sheet. And the Just Right 12 by 12 sticker sheet. They have a great boy theme collection called Mr. Boy. And it's got your great primary colors. It's a cute little text pattern there. This is um, called Borders and Blocks, and they have little these sheets for every collection. So they have the strips here that you can easily cut up and use as borders, and then they have the blocks with different titles and journaling spaces. I love that they've combined the two. This is the cute cuts. Twelve by twelve sticker sheet. In the twelve by twelve um, just right sticker sheet. Next, um, they've come out with something um, really cool called Sophisticates. And what this is, is it's basically all of your, um, they're just more neutral. They aren't necessarily geared toward a theme, but they have um, a lot of your basic patterns um, in all colors. And then just tools. Um, the orders are getting picked up right now by our post office worker. So um, lots going on in the background. Um, but as I was saying, they have a lot of different tools to just document everyday life, like this um, days of the week sheet with your basic stripe on the back. Here is a set of journaling cards. I love the, the rectangle um, shape in these with just your general topics. Cute bookmark. And um, there's also a 12 by 12 calendar set. It gives you lots of different options. I see 
several calendars just in this one sheet. And then I think you guys are going to love this. They have um, a 12 by 12 sticker sheets with a monochromatic alphabet set. And they have four different alphabet sheets here all in one set. Um, so be sure and look out for the alphabet sets and papers in all different colors. And then Bella Boulevard also has um, shipboard sheets in sticker sets here. So the, this set coordinates with the Sophisticates line, giving you different journaling areas. And then also um, an alphabet set with this cute little um, mini text in the background. Let's move on now to a little yellow bicycle. Okay, so here we are um, with the Elizabeth Park collection from Little Yellow Bicycle, and it's a little less noisy in this aisle, so um, sorry about that. This is a great spring collection. Lots of soft colors. Again, it's called Elizabeth's Park, and this is called Spring Song. With the little yellow bicycle um, paper, I'm noticing this side has a nice um, textured side, kind of like a little subtle linen feel to it. And then this side is flat. So if you're not a fan of the texture, you do have the flat side as well. Here is, let me see, this one is called Bloom Bands Lacy Lattice. Just a very subtle base border. This is Birds on a Wire. And I love how they've designed the wire here to have different cute little designs on it. And then the birds, um, they look sketched and then filled in with pattern. Very cute design. This is called Flutter By. This one is called Teal Dots. This one's a nice word art sheet. And then we have the die cut paper. It's a great doodled line. And then there is some um, thermography thermography, excuse me, treatment to the paper. All right, let's move on now to more Little Yellow Bicycle and Seven Gypsies. Here are the embellishments that coordinate with the Elizabeth Park Park Collection I just showed you. Um, these are the journaling card set. They give you great prompts like notes, simply perfect, thoughts, my perfect day. So there is 10 pieces in this. These are cute little metal pins with the flower design. You get 20 pieces here. And this is the envelope album kit. Um, so I'll let Lainey zoom in here. This is an, um, an idea of what the finished product would look like. And you get all the pieces that make this um, little mini albums, with, including five envelopes, different inserts, um, chipboard covers, pattern paper, um, even the little eyelet washers where the um, envelope closes, and the binder rings. These are cool. This is a tear-out ticket book. Um, great, also for journaling. And I'll just flip through this to show you. Um, this is perforated. You could even, um, some of these are more than just one piece. So a couple tickets. And then I want to also point out that um, I love that in this set there's some thermography treatment to the lines and text as well. So very cool. And now I have some of the new seven juices to show you. So we're going to move down the aisle here. There is a lot of good stuff I have to show you, including um, the different label stickers. Um, these are the apothecary labels, and you could put these on little mini jars that I'm going to show you in just a minute. Um, there are two sheets in here, and you can see you get a number of different shapes. 
Um, they also have a set in this multicolor. This is called Primitive Naked. And then um, this is the Primitive um, Word Label Stickers. Um, so it's really cute. They have um, different words like potion and fairy dust, um, collection of, so you can put these on the little labels if you want or you can use the bottles without the labels. They also have um, different um, label stickers with words on them, apothecary labels. So all of these would work on the little bottles I'll show you. And this one is called um, Chemistry. Why don't I go ahead and show you those now and then we'll move on to the others. These you're going to love. If I can reach. Whoa. Okay. So these are the cute little bottles. Um, see the cork is missing in one of them. Um, but you can just stick a label right on there or you could write a little note, roll it up and tuck it inside and put it on a gift. Um, so you get four bottles in each pack and they also come in the amber style. You can certainly mix and match. Such a fun product. Okay, so let's move back down and I'll show you the other thing. Another cool thing they've come out with is this collage tissue paper. This is the Paris Bird Song and Life. And I've seen um, these in their paper style, so it's fun that they have them in the tissue. So you could use them even in gift packaging, or you could use them um, in collages and paint over them and create layers and get artistic. Um, I'm going to show you the Camden collection in the 8x8 paper pack. This also comes in a 6x6 style as well as the individual papers. So keep in mind these patterns are shrunken down, um, but it's nice they have a thin weight if you are um, a fan of making collages, but they are double sided and nice quality paper. like a mix of library cards. There's that green on the back. So there's 48 pieces in this 8x8 paper pack. This is the Camden collection. If you checked out the featured project of the day, we have a cool mini album that we've spotlighted by one of our talented members who has created a mini book using the Seven Gypsies um, products, some of the tags and um, labels and things I've shown you. So if you are a fan of the mini book and want to create one of your own, these book covers are a great option. This is um, the Life is Good style and they're a nice um, chipboard weight and you can use them, um, you can punch holes in them, you can use it with their bindery punch and um, use a spiral bound spine. Um, and I just want to read what they have here. I think it's really cute. Maybe you should judge a book by its cover. It says these covers are just perfect for books that you make and are judged worthy. Very cute. So this is the conservatory style in a bigger size. And this one is the 6x6 six six size, different collage pieces that we've seen. Okay, I'm going to move up here to show you more of the new stuff. This is the family tag kit. And so these are an ATC size, this is an ATC kit, you get 21 pieces and here are all of the um, pieces included. These journaling cards with all these great words and prompts and then the cutouts as well. This one is called Affirmations. Again, more great sayings and you get a number set as well. 
This one is um, the Life is Good journal pages, and these would be great inserts with the um, book covers I showed you. There are 12 pieces included in this. Um, six styles, you get two of each. Okay. They have little mini sets. This one is called Receipts. So they have old vintage style receipts there. You get 17 pieces here. These are super fun. Garden girl Lisa Truesdell says that she um, loves tickets. I saw her tweet about it today, so I'm sure she's put it, these in her cart if not already. Um, if you've stayed the library drawer by Seven Gypsies, I'm just going to turn it over here. This is the library drawer. These are the file folders that coordinate with them. And they have here as a tip, you could stamp, alter, distress, or cover with your favorite papers to create custom tab dividers for any project. So people could put photos in there. You could even use it like a mini album. These are the Camden tags. So these coordinate with the paper pack I showed you. I love that they've put a little spot, empty spot here that you could easily just jot a note in. There are 20 pieces. These are the calendar tickets. Super cute. I love the big graphic here and then the small little numbers and the journaling space there. They also have them in the numbers. And that is everything I have for you today. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope you have a great week. Don't forget to comment on my blog for your chance to win. And again, happy St. Patrick's Day and happy spring. It finally feels like spring around here. All right, see you guys later.